In the recent past, Governor Ron DeSantis and others in the state of Florida and around this country have waged this war against making books accessible and available to students, to kids in classrooms, in libraries, because they feel that these books do what? That they make us see ourselves, that they make us see each other, that they make us better human beings because we're more connected, because books are mirrors and books are windows. And when we see each other, then we feel like we know each other because we're having hard conversations, because some of the books are challenging, because they're tough, wake up. This is America. America is about accessibility. It's about challenge. It's about being tough. It's about figuring out a way forward in the midst of chaos. This whole country was started out of chaos. Whether we're talking about slavery or whether we're talking about the Revolutionary War, or there are hard things that have happened to us. But the way we become better is by acknowledging them. We're not talking about them to make anyone feel guilty or to feel bad. We're going to feel what we feel. If you want to change the way people act, you change the way they think. You want to change the way they think, you change the way they feel. The best way to change the way people feel and to make them feel something is between the pages of a book, of a really good book. That'd be a really good time for me to say, like my books. But this ain't about me. This is about teachers, librarians, students, parents, families. This is about you all taking a stand, lifting your voice for this thing that matters. We shouldn't be banning books. We should be making all the books available to all the kids. The kids decide they don't want to read a book. They don't want to read it. I didn't want to read Tuck Everlasting when I was in seventh grade. If you don't want to read it, don't read it. But give them the choice. This is about choice. Isn't that what America was founded on? This idea of choice, the freedom to make those decisions for ourselves. The great Florida read-in. We got this, y'all. We're going to read strong. We're going to change the world for the better, one word at a time. I'm Kwame Alexander.